Well, I'm in uh, Koreatown. I have not been to this uh, part of the area, like I was saying before. That Van Nuys turned into a shithole. This is literally uh, a bigger shithole. I did not know it was at WIC. I was looking at WIC. What is it? It says Health and Nutrition. So basically, um, a lot of people come in here. I just got a Groupon deal to uh, get chiropractic adjustment. And some people said that it was great on the Groupon thing with this uh, adjustment. Kim Wu, uh, I needed adjustment to meaning chiropractic adjustment. I just want to show you the WIC. So basically, this is a pretty poverty stricken area. And I kind of uh, took a lot of terms from Vermont 101 and down to this uh, so called 8th Street little downtrodden neighborhood. Um, I just thought this is a quirky experience because I have never been down this part of the neighborhood <sighs> see if we can uh, uh, get a better look in fact this was really frightening I saw a rat I literally earlier I think the rat is still here I want to show it to you that the rat I don't know why I'm like so curious uh, this doctor is great but look at that there's the rat I don't know if you can see it Right there, he's, uh, I think he's sick or something. Uh, he's been there probably, Do you, can you see that? I don't, I don't want to get too close because it might have rabies. Can you see that? There's a rat down there. I mean, I'm just looking at this sucker and I go, all right, this is close to downtown, the Los Angeles, so it's supposed to be the richest, the capital of the, uh, United States, I mean, of California, and this is how rundown it is, worse than the shithole. Uh, if you all, you all, in, you know, if all you want to live in a shithole, uh, Guatemala is sort of a, a Venezuela type of country because everybody's depending on other people to feed them. Uh, that's why you see that WIC program, so called, that office was, was pretty packed with people I kind of did not want to uh, uh, you know go and try to interview them but look at this uh, this rat here has got one eye open and he's about to die on the street right next to downtown I don't know if you can see the skyline but this is eighth uh, that's how ridiculous California has become and that's why I said that uh, the the problem that they have created, I'm talking about Jerry Brown and cronies and Newsom, uh, and we can't get rid of them because they keep importing people that do not belong to this country so they can vote. So we have to do something. I don't know what it is. It's just ridiculous. Okay, in this midterm, so-called midterm election, uh, there's just so many things that they try to deceive you. They try to make you to vote for more property tax and they call that in the name of so-called rent control. And you know, you know, any control is government control. So uh, I have to find the uh, flyer from Howard Strover Tax uh, Association that they send a flyer. I, I need to get out of here. This is incredible. See that? I thought it was a grocery store and turned out to be a government subsidy. That's why this is a third world country, WIC. So all your tax dollars, which they keep on increasing and creating more problems and more homelessness and people getting these uh, lining up for these uh, WIC here uh, with rats dying on the street. And this is what your money going to pay for is to turn us into a shithole country. So I said, we need a revolution. We cannot live like this any longer. The founding father says that no more is no more. And that's what the Tea Party was all about, is that you cannot jump on my back 
and tell me that I have to give you every single freaking penny in my pocket so that uh, you can flood us with uh, uh, invaders. Okay, that's it.